That was pretty clever. That was a clever ending. How's it? Welcome back to Tama Takes Reviews. My name is Sean Tama. This is where I give you my take. A classic horror story. New Italian horror film now streaming on Netflix. And I gotta say the first 20 minutes, I was very frustrated because the, the actions that these characters were doing were just so stupid. To the point where I was like, are we really doing this? I know the title says a classic horror story, but like, are you really gonna be this stupid throughout the whole movie? Now, as I continue to watch it and we figure out what's happening, I get it, I understand it. But there's still just, for instance, a guy has been injured, he's in this trailer by himself. They hear a scream and the rest of the people inside this camper go off into this cabin where they hear the scream. They leave this dude by himself. It's also nighttime. So A, why are you going to where the scream is coming from? You have no idea where you are. If I hear a scream, I'm staying in the damn camper. That's a logical thing. Do you wanna go and figure it out? Go for it, I'm gonna stay right here. Now obviously if everyone decides to go, yeah, I'm gonna go, but you're, why would you leave this guy here by himself? It didn't make sense. And spoiler alert, the guy dies. He gets taken and it's pretty brutal. Pretty brutal death. This has plenty of gore. So if you're into that kind of stuff, you're gonna like it. You're gonna like it a lot. To set up this whole plot, they're driving and in the middle of the road is this goat I think that's killed already and the guy in the passenger seat decides to you can't hit it So you need to swerve Around it Camber smashes into the into the trees then they wake up and it's daytime now This happened at nighttime and now they've woken up and it's daytime and there's no road They're in the middle of this forest Surrounded by trees, but like it's like a plane where nothing's happening and there's one cabin So that's like what the hell's going on so that piqued my interest right there I will say though just pay attention and I think you'll figure out what's happening as it's going. It took me a little bit, but when all is said and done, looking back, I understand what was happening, how they decided to go about it. The negatives though, still, some of the characters still do dumb stuff. And I know that's almost inevitable, but I just watched another horror movie, the, uh, the Fear Street Trilogy Part Two. I didn't say that once. There was a bunch of people that got killed in that movie, not one of them, not one of those kills that I go, what the hell are you doing? That didn't happen. So it can, it can be done. They can make movies with characters who aren't stupid in horror movies. This is not the case in this one. But going from the title, makes perfect sense. And when you find out in the end what's happening, it will make more sense as well. And the ending is very clever. I should say the third act, when we find out the third act from the beginning of the third act, really enjoyed it. The ending, I think it ended too abruptly. I wanted more, I think, but from the title, a classic horror story, it does, the title is absolutely perfect for this film. So if you're a fan of horror, you like the gore, highly recommend this movie, should you watch it. Got it. So all of you horror aficionados, what did you think? Are you gonna watch it? Let me know in the comments below. I'll catch you next time. Shits.